Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back to the channel, y'all. Melanie and Gemini, Mr. Tarot, back at you again. Welcome, welcome to all my new subscribers. Welcome back. Welcome back to all my returning. Thank y'all for all y'all support and everything that you all do for this channel, y'all. Let's get into this message so I can tell you what's going on. Um, y'all, just be aware of what you have cooking on the stove. Make sure we ain't burning nothing up. Um, messages that I got, which is another day of messages. So today is move in silence. I understand like people want to, you know, show how happy they are about certain things, but everybody is not happy for you. You know, the enviousness that people have and the jealousy that people have because it's not them, it runs deep and it runs deep enough for them to be envious to the fact where they'll put some in the energy to where your trip will be delayed or, they'll do something to where you won't go or they'll put something in an energy to where the trip or the relationship or anything like that won't happen you just have to be aware of who you're around and keep people out your circle who don't need to be there and says don't tell no one what they um don't tell no one they're not always happy for you so that goes within like moving in silence don't announce until you have it or um or you know having it in general sometimes just not at all just just be quiet about things until it's time um i'm getting someone's in their feelings y'all i'm getting gas lighting. the gas lighting that they're doing isn't working um i'm getting to someone needs to take care of their car or there's going to be some type of car issue car problem um someone uh needs to check their credit card payments maybe someone's being charged too much or you didn't know the the hidden cost um i'm getting someone's working on their appearance or working on how they're looking trying different things what works for you what doesn't i'm getting to someone needs to listen to their body never ignore the need to rest i'm getting to someone someone fumbled a diamond you know someone couldn't see you gemini's they didn't realize what you were you know they just threw you to the side and then didn't realize who and what you were i was getting to they think because you don't show the world you can have a face beat designer clothes designer shoes and stuff that don't mean that you don't have it that don't mean like you're just going to show it off just because you do have it or someone that gets a BBL and, you know, they just got to show it off. They got to show off their body. And honestly, you didn't do it for you. You did it for how it would be perceived to other people, how you would look to other people. Me personally, I got my boobs done because, boy, look, I wanted to feel a certain way. I want to look right back great in the outfits that i did have and i just wanted that for me not for someone else to look at me and feel that i'm appeasing moving forward um they think because oh, hold on i already read that um okay so something about i i was here i was listening to uh to Linda Love's Tarot and Pocahontas really stuck out to me um when I was growing up or when I wear like real long hair weaves and stuff with a middle part they'd be like oh you you remind me of Pocahontas and then I'm getting um with Pocahontas like like when she said if you cut down if you cut it down it'll never grow so when I was thinking about that, they made me feel like, okay, if you're always around someone who's always cutting you down, always, you know, negative, always being a success hater, always being an always, you ain't going to grow. The relationship ain't going to grow. Making it all make sense. I'm getting to something about the black web, black magic. Someone's doing something to get rid of you and they got to do it in the quiet. I'm getting something about 555 change something dealing with change are um i'm getting to something about victory something is becoming new or something that you did making decision to separate from people there's new levels so always remember there's new devils as well 
I'm getting something about someone made a calculated move to stop you, but it didn't work. I'm getting to and learning lessons and getting blessings. So right now, y'all, right now you're being tested, but you've learned these lessons. It's just things that's coming back around. And I'm getting like you're learning the lesson so you can get these blessings. So hold on. There is the light at the end of that tunnel. I'm getting too greed is real. Maybe you were dealing with people who was greedy, who wasn't being honest. Maybe you was working with people and they decided that they weren't going to tell you all the rations that were made so that you can get your fair share. I'm getting watching people just to make sure they don't come your way. So, y'all, I can understand that because, y'all, I have certain people that I do not want to see, don't want to come my way. None of that. God got this. God got everything in control. The creator has everything in control. So, I don't need nobody to come my way um, or your way, whichever one makes sense. I'm getting to is balance coming for the imbalance and the unjust. So, making it all make sense, that were the messages. Let me put this right here. I wanna. I've been making some cards, y'all. I'm actually almost done. I got about 40 more to do. I just didn't want to come to y'all with a half-ass deck and trying to read off some half decks. So, y'all, let's see what we need to see for the collective Gemini's out of the confession of a soulmate. Let's see what we need to see for the collective of Gemini's. Let me get clear, clairvoyant, clear audience messages. You see me over here. Y'all know you see over there. I'm not sure if you see all them little papers and stuff over there. But, y'all, I've been trying to get them, them, them cars done. So, y'all, making it all make sense. Maybe someone has projects they're trying to um, get done. Maybe you found some, um, some, some, some roadblocks, but you're going to get out of those. So let's see. Someone that you was dealing with is insecure. They insecure of the money you make. They insecure of the smile on your face every day. They just insecure because you're happy. Someone thinks that you're theirs. Like you're their meal ticket. Like you're the one, you know, that they supposed to be with. But they keep on being with other people besides you. Making it all make sense. What else, spirit? I'm getting, you are, y'all, when I say mine, you are mine, like, this is weird. Someone is obsessed. Someone is a control freak. Somebody is someone that don't want you to be happy, but they're sorry now. They're insecure, but they're sorry. They're sorry now because you decided to leave and maybe they see you with somebody else. Maybe, so, I'm getting too, maybe someone um, left someone to be with someone else or Gemini, someone did you wrong, you left them, you healed someone good is coming to your life and they can't believe that they messed up and they sorry, but you know, they ain't that damn sorry. Maybe someone wants to come in with the message of love. They want to come in soon. They're going to come in to say that they are sorry or they apologize soon due to their actions, but it's going to be the same way. Maybe this is a dark skin or dark complexion person. There are going to be signs that let you know that this person is going to try to come your way and, and see if they can get a second chance. Mm -mm. Twin, y'all, signs. Boy, look, signs keep coming out. You're going to know. Someone's in regret. They're, you're you're probably getting signs of maybe messages. This person leaving messages, watching your channel and don't say nothing, watching your social media platform and don't say nothing. Or maybe... You know, someone's sorry, but then yet they're more so in regret because if they were sorry, I felt like they wouldn't have did it from the child. Make it all make sense. Something in divine timing is going to happen. So, yeah. Someone's in regret for what they did. They want to come back and they don't know how or it's not going to happen. Someone is getting divine guidance that divine timing is at play. What's in that play? I'm getting something about someone coming in, being weird, talking about some our love is real, but they really got this, you're mine, you're my possession, you're my property type of energy. They consider you their property. 
They don't consider you some. They'll tell you. They gonna tell you anything. Gaslight you up, and then turn around and you know what I'm saying. I'm getting predator energy. Like this person is is just watching you and scheming and obsessing and watching your whole life and forgot their whole life is falling a freaking part. Like someone watching you so bad. They watching you so bad. They around here burning the food. You around here ascending. You stepping into your higher power. And they can't even believe like how you got that quick like that. Y'all, I cannot. I cannot. I cannot. What else fear for the collective Geminis? What do I need to see? Give me clear, clear voice, clear audience messages for the collective of Geminis. I'm getting something about partying. Someone spending time with friends, having fun. Um, maybe someone's happily single. Maybe you're out with friends right now. Um, maybe you're going to go out this weekend. I'm getting two. Um, you cut ties with whoever this was. You're moving on. You are um, receiving what you need in your progression and that is arriving so when it seems like when you cut what whatever this situation was you was dealing with you're able to party and chill and you know live life at first you weren't able to you cut something off you i'm not sure if you see that but somebody cut something off somebody cut something off wasn't with it wasn't going down for it what else here for the collective of feminized a snake so you cut ties from the snake whether it be friends family lover frenemy whatever what else spirit i'm getting like now you're in paradise you're able to party you're able to be happily single you cut someone off so that you can find yourself find the things that you used to love to do because when you was in this situation it was like that was like a a dream or like a in you know something that wasn't gonna happen right now i'm getting something about yin yang energy not today you ain't dealing with someone today or maybe you're um partying with friends or spending time with friends so you can get your mind off a relationship with someone that's not doing somebody right what else spirit for the collective give me three more cards um yep this is someone you dating Maybe someone's finna get back out there and finna start dating again. But if you just got a relationship 60 days ago, 30 days ago, you're not ready yet. You're not even fully healed. But I'm getting some people are going out, having fun, you know, not having to worry about the codependency of others. <clears throat> you don't want to deal with someone that's probably finna come in. And they talking about they want to indulge in you man get out of here some people ain't good on that i'm getting like there's an ending there's a new beginning for you know coming in i'm getting something about someone being liberated or someone's being liberated from a court case or someone's in transition or some type something is happening y'all right now i'm getting something too somebody was so snakish and they were self-indulging in other people and partaking in other people and forgetting that y'all are in a relationship with each other. And I'm getting this person is a seductive person. They're probably attractive. They're doing little weird stuff. And there's going to be an ending to that. This is a snake. I'm getting something about a, uh, uh, someone's reminiscing. Someone's reminiscing on the seduction or the happy times or sexy times y'all had, but it's more to a relationship than that. That's boring if it's just sexy time. Get out of here. Then I'm getting karmic relationship. So <clears throat> I'm getting that whatever y'all had going on in y'all relationship and y'all stopped talking to this person, they moved on and found them another victim and doing this to them. Maybe you're feeling something, some energy that's not your own and it's coming from this person. I'm getting like you're a lighthearted person. You're very adaptive, but you are auto-clairvoyant. 
you know, you're empathic. Maybe you can read whatever the situation may be, or maybe you are a reader and you feel things. People may think you crazy, but you're not. Everything you say always come to pass anyway. <laughs> Making it all make sense. Let's get into this tarot. Let's see what I need to see for the collective of Gemini's. Let's see what signs. Y'all, when I say this moon card, y'all, I lie to you not, y'all. Moon card at its finest. I promise you, y'all, what is going on, spirit? Tell me the signs, the dates, the numbers. The whatever I need, the year of birth, all the way. Spirit, just give it to me. Give me what the collectives can handle. Because I know some of the collectives that are watching can't handle the truth that a Gemini is leaving or has left and then coming back. And they refuse to hear that Queen of Cups. <laughs> Conflict with the Queen of Cups. Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, female, or are they moving in a feminine energy? What spirit do I need to see? Eight of swords. Someone is feeling trapped and isolated in a situation or a relationship with a Libra, like sign Gemini, an Aquarius. I'm getting a page of wands. Somebody's dealing with a young-minded person. An over-sexual person. I'm getting there. It's a tower moment. So 816 is of significance. Or somebody was born on the 8th and or the 16th. Maybe someone's getting karma behind a younger person. Or someone who's either older or younger than you. Someone is leaving. So Gemini's. I'm getting. Someone is getting karma behind playing. Someone want, I'm getting somebody wanted to leave you in a weird situation. I'm getting you left someone because they were doing something weird they ain't have no business doing. The center of this reading, I'm getting like someone's sick. Something about 9, September, July. Somebody was dealing with two people. Somebody did not want this to be known. Somebody was giving a little thing to everybody. Sagittarius, Leo, and or Aries. This is going to cause a tower moment. Maybe someone's birthday is June 9th, June 7th. Someone's birthday July or September. I'm getting someone had a lot of options. This lot of options is going to leave someone either with an STD, something with a lot of baby mamas, or something like that, a sexually transmitted demon, making it all make sense, y'all. Maybe someone was born in 97. <clears throat> September 7th, July 9th. 797779. Maybe I've been seeing the numbers. Someone's name is JJ, Jamie, Johnny, Johnny. Maybe someone was born in 77, but somebody left someone when they realized that somebody was lying. They were being deceitful. They were stealing. They was doing a whole bunch of stuff cheating taking from one female to give to the other taking from one man to give to the next man type of energy ace of cups cancer pisces scorpio energy maybe someone's just saying 999 777 maybe someone's born in 87 somebody wanted to leave somebody trapped and i'm getting somebody left because of the betrayal I'm getting somebody around here doing a little weird stuff. You knew that they were doing weird stuff. Or you were in a relationship with someone who had multiple partners and you didn't want to be a part of that. There's an ending. There's going to be an ending. Maybe someone's birthday is March 1st, January 3rd. Or someone's birthday is uh, July 1st, January 7th. But there's going to be an ending. Someone has so many partners. With the Seven of Cups, the Death card, some were born July 13th, July 16th. Somebody ended up getting sick and spreading something to everybody. Mm. Knight of Pentacles in reverse. 
something coming in fast. Someone's giving something fast. Something is coming in fast. Y'all need to be aware of who and what y'all are sleeping with. Because everybody ain't going to be straight. Everybody ain't going to be honest. I'm getting someone is having strength. Someone is going to have strength. Maybe someone has been seeing eight, like I said. Something about August or even a Leo. What else, spirit? Go with all the way over there. I'm getting the Knight of Cups, y'all. Someone going to try to come in with love or present something to you like they're in love with you, but if they got something that you don't know about, a lie, choices, options, spreading stuff, things supposed to be spreading, two of cups energy, mm -hmm. someone gonna be up at night due to this two of cups energy, y'all, due to this cups, due to this two of cups, is someone gonna be like this? Someone gonna be around here having nightmares, insomnia and anxiety and fear, Moon card. Someone's probably sleeping because they know they with someone else or had somebody else, and that's the secret. Someone has somebody else. Someone is upset and crying over spilled milk. Somebody knew someone had somebody else. Queen of Pentacles, Virgo, Capricorn, Taurus, woman, lovers, energy. Maybe someone had big boobs. The other one didn't. Someone's waiting. Someone's waiting on an opportunity with you, but they have all of this going on. Someone got an opportunity waiting on you, and they have all these options of people. They with this person for money. This person's a snake. They don't know who this person is. They just talk to them online. Like, they got a number one. They got a name, main one, but they got others. Mm -hmm. Making it all make sense, y'all. Bottom of the deck. Someone working hard. To try to figure out where you at. Can they come to you? They see you as high honor. They see you as a star now. They see now, now, now they see you as a star. After they some throw dirt and I don't want you and I'm with them and did that and that didn't work out and all that. Now it's like you, they ten of pentacles. Or I'm getting you're of the ten of pentacles now and they want to come out for a handout. Knight of Wands, y'all. Something is coming in, y'all. I'm getting some type of conflict that's trying to come in and someone trying to up and root what you got going on. But y'all, let's return that back to its sender. Thank y'all for y'all like, y'all shares, and y'all subscribe. This is your morning message. If you're trying to get a reading from me, remember, members only get them every day of the week. If you're not a members only, weekends are the days that my book is open for you all. Until the next one, peace, love, prosperity, and protection. Readings over there on members only at $33.33. If you're not a member yet, it's 50 50 50 50 $55.55. Um, I'm going to have some name brand purses, designer purses, handbags, however, whatever. You know, even though, you know, the authentic, I'm having an issue with posting them. So, you know, if you're trying to hit me up to see what type of, you know, bags and stuff that I have, um, contact me. Hit me up. You know, I got Zelle, Vimu, all of that. So, you know, until the next one, y'all. Peace, love, prosperity, and protection.